Hello everyone, today I'm here to record a new update on my game. I know that I have not recorded a new update in quite a while now. And that is why I need to record a new one. So, I basically added a competitive mode. What this will do in the future is that you can compete with other players for points or maybe resources. I have not decided yet and competitive mode is basically a testing mode for now. Survival mode, on the other hand, is actual survival. So if I just play by myself in command mode, these are some new features I've added in the game. So for one, I have better weapon play. This is not a very good new feature. It, was, it just adds a nice feel to the game. Two, this is the main feature. The bullets are no longer raycast. What I mean is, before, in the previous updates, when you shoot... <coughs> Shoot, uh, the game would draw a line to where you would hit and put a bullet hole in it. Now there is actually a moving bullet <laughs> for, more realistic, for more realism, and the bullet actually falls to gravity. What what that means is I can also do bullet ricochet. So if I like shoot at this block at a weird angle, <laughs> see far away is actually getting hit as well. And if you look, flying <laughs> away. So, all the weapons have been updated to use this, <laughs> and also the new burst system adds a new sound system as well. So when you shoot, you will hear that sound, and it's not nearly as loud as before because of some complaints. And even though the sound, if someone were to stand next to where your bullet is flying, you will hear a wooing wooing sound as the bullet flies by. Also, okay, there's the flashlight. The shotgun the shotgun <coughs> shoot forever now. Like if I go farther away, shotgun might not use the tube. So basically the shotgun uses these new bullets and I have put a range on them, so they will fall to the ground pretty quickly. So yeah. And we have added a sniper rifle into the game. Sniper rifle is very useful, it is one shot kill on any player or zombie, and it's just for testing for now the one shot kill system. So when you zoom in, you can see that there's a crop there, and here's the cool part. When you shoot, you can actually see the bullet going forward and falling down. So like Okay, you can't really see while I'm recording for some reason. And if I show you, now, you'll probably be able to see. Okay. So, well, because the recording is a bit laggy, also know I'm getting 12 frames per second, so you can't actually see the bullets. But if you play by yourself and without recording, you can see the bullets going forward and falling down, kind of like the battlefield. So yeah. So now I will go into survival mode. Also, the bullets, since they are physical bullets, you can actually shoot something like this tube, shoot it, and it goes super far away. Probably gonna fall off the edge, yeah. So yeah, now I'm going to go into survival mode. So I am back in the menu, and I will go in survival mode. We've actually added a map to the survival mode. Not a very good one, but over flat land. So the zombies will spawn like last time, but they have better AI, they can walk around stuff, and they will chase you around. So if I shoot them, they will die. The sniper is very good in survival mode. If I go to the top of that mountain, I will actually be able to snipe people. And survival mode used to be a giant forest before I cleared the tree because it was extremely laggy and I could not record. So, if you shoot him, he dies. I'm sorry I cannot actually have any real fun today because my friends are not available at the moment. So, I'm just demonstrating some game features. So, also the uh, new bullet system has penetration. So, if I shoot a zombie, like that one, it should hit the one 
behind me. Okay, I missed. Okay. Sometimes it works, and sometimes it's not in front of me. The sniper is actually very overpowered, as you can do. Just walk up to someone, and you shoot them. There's also a new sprinting animation and it looks a lot nicer and it actually looks like you are sprinting. So that is basically it for this. <coughs> oh yes, I forgot to show you the <coughs> lean. The lean is basically a feature of the game where you can lean left and right like this. It's very useful, so if you are behind cover you can lean out and fire. Like that. <laughs> but I don't actually have any cover to go behind it. So I cannot show you uh, how it is actually useful. But in multiplayer, I have tested with my friends on the competitive map, and it is very useful if you hide behind things like that cube. You can lean out and fire, and they cannot hit you while you can hit them. So they will have to find some cover or run towards you. That's basically the end of this update. Thank you for watching.